Hi, what's up, y'all? It's poppin' it. Do you boss react to this video by All Access Media? It's titled, Zonique is big mad after baby daddy Izzy's brutal reveal to her face. He never wanted her. Okay, I saw this pop up on my homepage on IG, but I kept scrolling because I was like, what? It looks like a, a little couples thing or such. Like they were doing a couples tag or something on YouTube maybe. I don't know where they put it, but I wasn't interested. But then someone told me to check it out and they said that uh, T.I.'s, kids continue to embarrass him and I was like oh <laughs> let, let, let's see exactly what's taking place I don't know if she mentions T.I. or what but sure let's see what's going on so Zuni decided to sit down with her baby daddy band hunter Izzy and he basically Ooh, just embarrassed the hell out of her and she allowed it so I'm gonna go ahead and let you guys look at the clip basically he, he said he wouldn't even head? be with her the only reason he is with her or he's around her is because that they have a daughter together Ooh. Do you think that we would be together if we didn't have a child? And why? No. They asked me some good questions. No. Why not? Where did they put this? Because I feel like a lot of shit, you had an image in your mind of raising on with a, with a, with a two-parent home. Oh, so you tolerated a lot of shit. So you just stayed. I wouldn't be with you either. Oh, he said you tolerated a lot. So he cheated. Because I have four kids, and this is the only kid that I was in the household with from start to finish, so it's something that I don't want to take from her as well. But I was a dad. Like, kid, you took that damn girl. Oh, what? Oh, bro. Oh, this is not the shit, bro. That, that I just don't tolerate from bitches, bro. We do a lot of From bitches? No, I'm not. What? I'm what do I be doing? And what do I be doing to you? Tell them one thing that I be doing to you. Bro, your attitude, first of all, like we just went through with our whole fucking, with my fucking. Like, goddamn. Do you think, did you know I was the one? What makes you think you the one? Oh, all right, girl. Why would you post? <laughs> what made you know that I was With the baby? baby? The baby what is even sad at your stupidity. I want to marry her. I, I never thought I would. You never thought that in your whole entire fucking life? You don't really sit here and tap like that and you say that you I never thought I was, I never, the thought that was in my mind was, I was. So why are you asking me marry What? Twice. When did I do that? Not proposing through a text message. You said when I get back, can we get married? All right. Oh my. Oh. And then, and then, when we got, when you got here, you asked me. You said, "Can I get married?" And what you said? I said no. <laughs> I would say no too. Do a fucking text. Come on, brother. You know I ain't never proposing nobody to get. Did you know I was probably when I realized I was dealing, I was dealing with shit differently with you than I was dealing with like. I'm ch I'll change it myself for you. Try shit. Aww. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, that would be but it's not really, it's not really good to change yourself for somebody yeah. else. You should even be, that's what, that's what I'm saying. Like, I don't like tell myself things a different person. Yeah. Now, when I tell y'all people have something oh to say God. on social media, they went in. One person said that video of Zanique X and Baby Daddy, he basically said he knew he could get away with what he does because she has no standards and will do anything for a two-parent household, Yay. trifling. Someone else said Zanique backpedaling, trying to make it sound good. If you really ain't care why you set the camera up and do that video, what was the point? Someone else said Zanique Baby Daddy didn't even hesitate to tell her he didn't even want kids and he basically didn't like her that much because of her attitude. Sisters, I need y'all to stand up, please. Someone else said, yeah, that Harris household has to be a strange one. King is Malibu's <laughs> most wanted hot mess. Still invested in YouTube. Oh, wait, was that her? Y'all still invested. This is what irritates me about these fucking people. You put us in your business. You did that. This wasn't leaked. You set up this camera, recorded this video, and uploaded this on YouTube. And now you're saying, oh, why you, why you in my business? About something you posted. Girl, shut the hell up. Other people business. YouTube, and it goes viral. I mean, obviously you want people in your business. That's why you're doing YouTube because if people is not in your business, you won't get any views on YouTube. 
when you look at the video, you can I see that he really video. doesn't like her. He <laughs> doesn't want to be with I, her. I to see and this. like he said, he's only around her because they have a daughter together. And know. he was there from the beginning, so he wants to stay there. Why not be there? Because you love this woman. She's the mother of your kid, and y'all got a good bond together. It's none of that. They might kids? as well separate and live separate lives. But you guys, let me know your thoughts in the video. Oh my god, this was horrible. This was so embarrassing. I was not expecting this. I don't know why I expected them to be talking shit about Ti. <laughs> oh, because the person who requested this, they said that Ti's kids are embarrassing him. I thought maybe this would be another like NBA young boy and Yaya situation. And he was like, "Fuck your bitch ass daddy." <laughs> but this was even worse, child. What the hell? And listen, I don't even like talking shit about women who are with men who who are not shit because I feel like we've all been there, you know. If you have any type of dating experience, any type of relationship experience, you have more than likely dealt with someone who treated you less than at some point. So people have to live and learn and grow. So I, I try to, you know, give women the the space to do that to learn and and do better. But, girl, this man in your face is saying, like, girl, I don't want you. Like, if it wasn't for the kid, I wouldn't even be here. Who's I want to marry you? You ain't the one. Like, God damn. And why would you post this on YouTube for everybody to see? I don't know if she was trying to get sympathy points or if she wants people to know that he's trash so that he can get hate or something. I don't know what her goal was, but this was very embarrassing. I would have never posted this. This would not have seen the fucking light of day. Like, girl, what? <laughs> and then even her whole... Uh, reasoning for dealing with his bullshit and staying with him when he clearly is saying he doesn't really want her. And her reasoning is, oh, so, you know, her child can have a two-parent household. That's a very dumb reason to stay with someone because if you're not happy, your kid is going to feel that. If y'all are arguing all the time, your kid is going to hear that and witness that and be around that. You're subjecting your child to more trauma, I feel like, staying with the dad when y'all are not a good fit, when you're not happy with them, when they're not happy with you. I never understood that. People are so caught up on this fucking fairy tale land that they live in and, oh, on TV, people are in two-parent household and on social media they said we're supposed to do this so i'm gonna force this no you cannot force that it is worse for the children when when they're witnessing arguing all of the time i can't tell you how many times i've had to deal with the toxicity of my parents like my, before my parents got divorced they were arguing and into it all the time it was all type of shit going on and when they finally told me and my sister that they were divorcing we were like finally thank you please go your separate ways we don't want to keep hearing this like it's worse <laughs> for you to stay in a fucking relationship with the the other person when you guys are not a good fit it's worse for the kids hello stop trying to force it that is so dumb when people do that. I really hope they split up and go their separate ways so they can both find peace because y'all are subjecting this child to nonsense, I'm sure. Like, it, it's just dumb. I hate that. Y'all let me know what y'all think, though. Let me know what other videos you're going to watch, and I'll see you on the next one. Bye!